what is going on guys I found my camera I'm pretty excited and uh, I got an order in today so I got some coral RX dip I got some reef carbonate which is my uh, alkalinity sea chem I got a sulfur magnesium kit and I got some Aptasia X to fix the problem behind me which I'll show you guys in a minute and then I got I'm actually really excited I found my camera Casey actually found it I got this big big old 7 inch nylon mesh filter sock for the uh, the new build the big build the good old big build so I got some Aptasia X here Red Sea shout out to them I'm gonna try this out and I will uh, I've only heard good stuff about it, so I've got a real major problem here, guys, on my hands. There's like they're everywhere. They're everywhere. They're killing coral. Like my my SPS is so nice. Well, this camera doesn't really focus too well on it, and the glass is not too clean behind there. But those polyps are just huge when it fills up. But there's just aptasia everywhere on it, all over the place. They're all under all under the rack they're everywhere they're just spore and spore my RBTA is looking not too shabby not too shabby it's hard to clean the glass there. I don't like disturbing it but it's it's really bubbling out today it's really bubbling out I don't know I just I figured I'd uh, show you guys uh, my little problem and I was pretty excited that my that Casey had found my camera so I'm going to uh, get back in the groove of filming everything oh, just look at them there's just so many of them this is all from what one or two pieces of live rock from this big Tonga branch that I got from my buddy well, my buddy, I say my buddy, but yeah, this poor, we got this big rock here. It was full of zoas and they just kept falling off because all of the, all of the aptasias are just, ah. Uh, but we're going to get rid of it. The skimmer is doing his job, He's doing a good job like usual. The Aqua Remora C with the upgraded pump. Which has got algae on it, but you know what? Meh. It's. I got really low nitrates, so. But my alkalinity was really low, so that's why I got the reef carbonate. I, uh. I don't know. Got low nitrates, so I figured I gotta. I'm gonna have to dose a little more. I'm usually regular water changes all the time, so I never have to dose, but. I've been prolonging my water changes now. And it seems like uh, I figured out what the problem was. That's why I got the magnesium test kit as well. My magnesium was at uh, 1300 this morning. So, not too, not too low, but not too high either. The corals look good though. Besides for all these aptasias, which are gonna be going today. Most of them anyways. Most of them anyways. The other tank is looking good as well. I just have that frag rack in there so that it's just seeding. The angelfish just runs and hides. There's the damsel over there. Got a little bit of algae in here still. I haven't picked it out. I was going to see if it was going to go away on its own. This tank is fairly new. So yeah guys, I just wanted to uh, show off that my camera has uh, been found. I got some uh, Aptasia X and I got the Salifert Magnesium Coral RX Coral Dip The Reef Carbonate Raises Carbonate Alkalinity I love Sea Chem stuff and uh, the big old reusable filter sock 
that's for the uh, the good old big build so if you're happy that I uh, found my camera give this video a like and uh, I'm going to get pizza actually Casey's over there saying we gotta go get the pizza so uh, it's pizza time and then uh, oh sorry big mama and then it's uh, then it's Aptasia X time alright guys so uh, more videos to come there goes Zeb. Have a good day, everybody.